To think you have this much will to survive. Very well. To fucking think I have this much will in general. Jesus. Shall be your opponent. Next time we meet, your life will be over in no time. <laughs> All right, saving it up. Got fifty. I I can't wait to see how how low that fifty eight retries will go at the final battle. <laughs> Jesus. All right, Astaroth. Metrio Zendos, give me your fucking. This damn thing. I've been climbing forever. Really? Give me your fucking last question. Now sit down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's entertaining to witness someone becoming a legend. It doesn't happen often. First, I must praise you for having survived thus far. This bullshit again. What do I have to tell you this time? What makes you so desperate? Isn't it obvious? I'm gonna get back what I lost. Hmm. Now let me ask, what are you living for? For my fucking self. The point of asking questions at this point in your game. Life isn't so simple that I can just boil it down that easily. Just, who are you? What do you mean? Uh huh. That's the curse. There's no escaping this place without having an answer of some sort. You may be different from the average man, but that doesn't mean I can let you go. I'll hear what you truly wish for. This is the last question to freedom. Which of these do you truly wish for? Okay. Peaceful days, chaotic excitement. Which one? Oh, shit! He said, are you lawful good or chaotic neutral? What do you want? Fuck. Uh, damn it. Damn, I don't know. Uh, like, I'm not the type of person to go, like, fucking Which join riots and shit. But I also don't want no fucking desk job. This uh, fuck. Um. Damn, I don't know. Shit! Which one? I think I want that one the most. <laughs> That's your answer. All right, I understand. Everything is prepared now. I can finally guide you to the stage where you'll fight him. There was once a man who took up this challenge, just like you. This man became a legend. He stopped being human and became one of us. <laughs> yes, he is Thomas Mutton, the one awaiting you at the next trial. Now that he has become one of us, we call him Dumuzid. All the traps were created by him. He knows this place through and through, making him a difficult opponent. So he used to be a human. Well, I'm not gonna lose to him. Does that mean I can become a god too? Ooh, <laughs> that's awesome. Other players answered. Okay, I'm not gonna argue with that. Is this the final one? Please tell me it's the final one. Please don't. God damn it. There's no door shaped icon, so fucking I don't know if it's final or not. You will now be faced with the creator of the Great Trials. Use all the techniques you've learned to avoid his fierce attacks. The time has come. I remember this one being really fucking... Not, not difficult, but more on the annoying side. <sighs> Starting to lose your nerve. <laughs> You'd actually make it here. That was a marvel to watch. Well, it seems the others were altogether too easy on you. So for tonight's extravaganza, I shall deal with you personally. 
And you remember our deal, right? As I said, you have nothing to be concerned That gun is gonna be a pain in my fucking ass. It's a pity. But try not to get too worked up over it. Shut up! Let's get this over with already. I'll outrun you, too. Catherine, wait for me. I love how the main thing of this game is I'll fight you by running away like a coward. Do not die. I can run away like the like the best of them. That gun's gonna be a pain in the ass. Oh my god. I'm just looking at it right now. Cause I remember that thing being the thing that killed me the most. Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, don't scare me like that, Mr. Mutton. Mr. Mutton Chops. Uh, fuck. Oops. What I just do? Let me let me undo that, cause I don't know what the fuck I literally just did. I'ma just put that over there. Pull this over here. Fuck you, let me get my checkpoint first. You're a cunt. Oh, you're gonna shoot again, you fucking bastard. My, and I bet your I, I bet your mom never loved you, did she? Oh that thing's crumbling. We're almost at the halfway point. Pretty sure that's where it's gonna get real annoying. Oh, there's ice. Go fuck yourself. Oh, what? What did you just do? Woo! Oh, come on. That's unfair, man. Whatever. That's really unfair. What the fuck? You won't die, will you? Fuck. You just, you just literally made me get stuck. No. Back off. You literally just made me get stuck. I don't... Okay. You need to run. Oh, he shot the bomb? Good job, Mutton, you fucking idiot. Damn it, I fucked up. Wait, which way did I... You need to put that gun away. It's not gonna help anybody. It's not gonna help me, for the most part. You don't have any time. <sighs> Fuck. I'm dead. I dodged the bullet. You won't die, will you? No, I won't die, motherfucker. That, that's the point. I don't want to die. Put that gun away. You don't need a gun. You don't have any time. You're like a god or whatever. Why the oh, fuck? Why would you need a gun? Oh no. That gun is like the scariest weapon that he has. Ooh. Oh, you just you made a good Oh, what the fuck? No! You bastard! I don't know what I just did. What did I just do? I went the wrong way. Put the fucking gun away, man! You need to run. Fuck! Fuck, I'm scared. <laughs> Fuck, I'm scared. Good man, dead. He shot two of them? What the fuck, man? Unnecessary. Come on, I need that. Mutton, you're being very unfair. You're getting rid of you're getting rid of blocks I do not need to be getting rid of. Getting rid of? Ugh. What the hell did I just say? No, I 
don't. I don't want to die. You don't have any time. Get, get, get going. Get going, Vincent. You got it. Vincent. You gotta go. Vincent, a little faster would be nice. Fuck! Jesus. Put the fucking mallet in the gun and everything away. Thanks for restoring that crumble block for me, actually. That was pretty nice of you. Can I have another checkpoint, please? We're almost at the end, man. Can I have another checkpoint, please? 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 Oh, you're a bastard. Oh, wait. Did I fuck that up? Oh, checkpoint! You put that gun away. If you shoot me before I get that checkpoint, I will, I will, I will, I will tell your superiors. You don't have any time. No! Ah! Damn it! I saw it coming. I wasn't fast enough. Fucking, I, I grabbed one of the wrong blocks. That's that fucked me up. That split second. That split second minor fuck up. It's always that stupid ass gun that he has. You need to run. Boy, stop moving. I will not stop moving, Mutton. I, if I stop moving, I will, I will most, most certainly die. Ah! I'll most certainly die. And I don't want that to happen. Nope. What the hell did you just do? Oh, okay. Go fuck yourself, Mutton. I'm almost at the top, and you can't stop me. Don't stop me now. Having such a good time. I'm having a ball. Don't stop me now. If you wanna have a good time, just give me a call. Don't stop. There's a bell? Oh, you son of a bitch. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. Hey, Mutton, how you feel about this shit? How you feel about that shit? You better not use your mallet. If you use your mallet, I'ma fucking, I'ma hurt you. Haha, -ha, you bastard! Go fuck yourself. Go fuck yourself. Cause I'm having such a good time. I'm having a ball. Go fuck yourself. If you wanna have a good time, you give me a call. I'm sorry, I'm really happy right now. <sighs> Jesus, I was having a heart attack. Woo! I almost made it through it without a death, though. I just had that one slip up. Curse you, sheep! How could this happen? Oh! Very well. This makes it war, boy. I swear, in the name of Dumazid, the shepherd, consort of Ishtar. Dumazid. Nice name. Prepare yourself. <laughs> I just love the idea of the old man just going, of an old man just going like, your ass is mine, punk. <laughs> beat your ass. I'ma beat your ass like like I did back in the day. All right, come on. Whew. Final trial. This tower is really tall. Mutton asshole isn't gonna keep throwing these at me forever until I die, is he? Don't worry, there will be an end to this. A pinnacle. The next stage will be your last, I assure you. So come, sit down. Oh, You're finally here. Above this place is a path that reaches to the heavens. You finally appeared. A man with potential. I've been waiting for you. Waiting for me, huh? Are you trying to kill me this whole time? This is a sanctuary where we give those with potential a baptism and freedom. This is a game of death where experience and intuition are your only tools to survive. There is no right and wrong. Tomorrow only comes for those with the power to overcome the challenge. Yeah, I kind of already knew that. This is all a dream in my head. If this is my dream, and no matter what comes my way, I know I'll be able to handle it. 
<laughs> you are bold. So different from the man who first entered here. My job here is done. You've successfully endured the baptism. Coming next will be the final trial of the heavens. This will be your last battle. I am always near you. I have many faces and many names. When this sanctuary is bathed in Ishtar's love, I'll see you again in a place far removed from here. Somewhere else? Keep your eyes up and go. Hey, have to tell me twice. You sure love to talk right up to the end. No final question, huh? All right, let's keep going. The final trial awaits. <sighs> At, I'm excited. At the same time, I'm not because I really don't want to do this. I remember this part being easier than the last part, though. Like from the last time I played this game. Of the great trials is upon us. This is the ultimate test. Face the gods' full power with all your might. When you reach Heaven's Door, you will gain true freedom. Heaven's Door is one of my favorite stands. How long is this gonna go on? <sighs> this is tougher than I thought. This filthy cheater is faster than I expected. Screw you! I'm not playing games here! I'm almost there! Who's gonna win tonight, bitch? What are you talking about? I was just messing around! Just making you come! I didn't know there was a spring there. Okay, uh, fuck. Let's see. Where could we go? We can go this way. Hello. I'll use another spring. All those springs. What? Oh. I'll just move this over then. There we go. Okay. All right. Um. Woo. It'll be nice if I can just if I can just move to the side there, but I don't think I can. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. Fuck. I'm surrounded by black blocks. What the hell? Why didn't I realize that? Okay. I didn't realize that there was a uh, black block. Uh, fuck. Uh. Yeah. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize there were black blocks around me. Um. Shit. What does this do? Oh, what? You son of a bitch. You can't do that. Using his fucking Kamehame waves. Oh, what? How would I, uh, huh? I wanna, I wanna cheat. I wanna cheat and use the, use the spring, but I can't. But, 
Well, I fucked that up. Let's see. I really like to use the spring to my advantage, but I don't think I can. Fuck. Hmm. This doesn't really help me at all. Oh wait, I can just do that, right? Yeah, that should be fine. And then, uh, do this, and then do this. What the fuck? What did you do to me? What did you do to me? What is this shit? What kind of curse did you put on me? You son of a bitch. Ice. Oh yeah, cool. Thanks for switching the ice one, dumbass. Oh, a spring one? Awesome. Dumbass. Thank you. What did you just what did you just do? Oh what? Oh you're a fucking bastard. The fucking the stupid thing that just did that. Mm -hmm. Alright, motherfucker, guess I'll go the other way then. Go fuck yourself. Oh, you're a cunt. Ooh, I almost killed myself. What the hell am I doing? What am I doing? Where am I? Faster, 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 go. Okay. Oh, you're a fucking asshole for what you just did, Mutton. You're an asshole. You're an asshole. You're a fucking dickhead. Fuck. Stop. Switch my blocks. Fucking ice blocks, you bastard. Now you got fucking monster blocks in my path. But <sighs> things a pain in the ass. What the hell? Spring block, help me. Oh no! Fuck! Fuck, what are you doing? Don't change my fucking block. You son of a bitch. Oh, fuck. What did you just change that block into? A black one? Okay. Uh, now a spike one? Uh, not, not too bad. Did that monster one just try to kill me? I think it tried to kill me, but I think it failed. Oh! No! It's a 
Stop cursing me. Stop cursing me. It's not good. Listen, stop. Stop cursing me. It doesn't even help you sometimes, man. Sometimes it makes things more difficult for you. Oh, you're a fucking cunt. You're a cunt for this. It will not be forgiven easily. One, two, three. Oh, fucking son of a bitch. I did not think that he would do what he just did. Ah, oh, okay, you made it to black block. That's not too bad. Oh no, why did I fucking do that? Where was my last checkpoint? Okay, it wasn't too far away. All right. Damn it! Like I fucked up. That was my bad. That was basically user error. I don't know why I keep pulling out three of those. I don't really need to. Uh. But I think I need to pull three of them out here at least. This time I'm gonna do this, pull out two of them. Make like a better pathway. Make better pathway. Grab this. Can you fucking grab the goddamn You dare resist a god? You dare resist a god? Stop cursing me, you son of a bitch. What did you just do? You're a, f you're a fuckhead. You know that, man? Uh. I just saw a spring block and I thought I could use it. But, where did my fucking. I was wondering where, like, my, my fucking blocks went. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. One. Forward. Uh, it's not gonna stay there. Okay. Then I then I really had no need to to push that out. An ice block. Great. Thanks, Mutton. Monster block. Uh, shit. I guess I do dare resist a god. How how dare I? Right? How how dare me? Fuck. I don't have enough uh, spacing. I need to pull out at least one more block or something like that. Why'd you just do that? You're a fucking asshole. Fuck. 
fucking yeah, he keeps switching these damn things to monster blocks, so I'm gonna hurt you. Whatever. I'd rather have it like that. Uh, the meteor's getting heavier. Can you... Mutton, can you please not? That thing almost fucking killed me. <sighs> Are they just gonna give it to me for free? Just give it to me. Just give it to me. I don't have to reach it. I'm already there. Just give it to me. Please. Just give it. Fuck. Fuck. Give it to me. Finish this game. still what you think? Look, men and women, they're more complicated than you think. You're just being selfish. All right, Mutton. What I want doesn't really matter. I mean, people's lives aren't planned out for them. There's no road map. Despite what you may think, we don't need any hurting. <gasps> I mean, I can't claim to be the greatest guy in the world or anything, but I am human. And I'm free to choose how I live. You... You insolent little man! Well, thank you, but I still won. You made me go through these stupid dreams night after night. From now on, my life is my own! St stop it! Great escape. You survived. That's the words I needed to hear. <sighs> I feel like a weight has been lifted from my shoulders. I wonder what ending I got. It's morning. Hey, what?
what's going on? Orlando sent me this text saying that we should all get together since it's been a while. <laughs> and the bartender came and picked me up himself. What gives? Yeah, I'll explain that in a second. But first, thanks for coming. <sighs> so where is everyone? Why is it just us here? I had Orlando text you. I wanted to talk with you myself. But you wouldn't answer any of my calls. <sighs> so, what is it? It's over. I don't want to talk about it. Don't you get it? Yeah, I do. But I need to tell you something. Why am I putting up with this? <sighs> Vincent. <sighs> what is it? This is your last chance. It was all an illusion. Huh? What was? My cheating. Huh? There never was another woman. Are you kidding? I'm not gonna believe that. I know it's hard to believe, but I'm telling you the truth. I, I never cheated on you. <laughs> Don't be stupid. I'm serious here. I, I was losing it, and... And I thought I was cheating. I know, I know, it all sounds like bullshit. I was driving myself crazy too. I mean, I mean that's a problem in and of itself, but... Hey, are you serious? It's all true. My friends and the boss here showed me that it was all in my head. You don't expect me to believe this. No. I just didn't want it to end with a misunderstanding. That's why I had you come here. I'll never do it again. I can promise you that. You dumping me finally made me realize I need you. Will you give me the chance to make it up to you, please? Right. I understand everything. But... Vincent, we can't go on anymore. Don't do this. I can make you happy. I promise. You can't just... It's over between us. What you want is excitement. It's written on your face. I'm going now. Wait, Catherine... Goodbye. Huh? Well, that's that. Besides, you did all you could. Well, you won't get those nightmares anymore. Why don't you give it another try? When things settle down. No, it's okay. I'm just really tired. But hey, now you're really free, right? You can sleep with anyone you want. It's not cheating now. Uh, uh yeah. Look at the bright side of things. Oh, for the love of... Men are pathetic. Vincent? Uh, hey, you okay, buddy? <laughs> He's asleep. How can he sleep right after being dumped? Man, who does that? Well, you can't blame him. He hasn't slept for a week now. Sure. Whatever. <laughs> Boss, give me my usual. You got it.
<laughs> Jeez. Hello, everyone. It's nice to be able to see you again. How'd you enjoy the show? A perfect escape from the terrifying nightmare. You led Vincent out with your exceptional skills. Even Astaroth, the mastermind behind the nightmares, was amazed. Did you happen to notice the central conflict that this game's masterful creators placed at its core? Do you want to live a comfortable and steady life? Or do you secretly long for a free life? Full of excitement. In the nightmare, Astaroth said that there is no right way to climb the tower. The stairway Vincent was forced to climb could be taken as a metaphor. It symbolized the journey to adulthood, pressuring him to make his tough life decisions. Don't you agree? Vincent finally gained his freedom, but it looks like he and Catherine have no future together. But was married life with his estranged lover really the answer to Vincent's troubles? You know, maybe this is actually a good ending for him. After all, now he has the freedom he was so desperately clinging to. Isn't that one way to look at it? <laughs> Although, I do feel sorry for him right about now. Thrown back into single life. Good thing his friends were there to cushion the fall, huh? Well, what did you players out there think of this outcome? For those who aren't satisfied, you can always try again. This is, after all, <laughs> the Golden Playhouse, and I'll be your host for as long as you like. <laughs> Games are lovely creations, aren't they? <laughs> Hope to see you soon. Stay golden. Okay. <laughs> man. Oh, man. Well, that's a Catherine for you. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll make sure to show off all the other endings. You know, I, all the other endings and probably not not the Tower of Babel stuff, because that's probably too complicated for me. Uh, but yeah, um, when it comes to our particular ending, I think I'm, I like the bittersweet ending. Vincent got what he wanted, but at the same time, you know, he doesn't have Catherine anymore, so that's sad. But hey, I mean... In Catherine full body, there's a third option now. It seems to be a third option. So who knows where where that may lead. But overall, as always, when I finish my playthroughs, I like to give my general thoughts of the game kind of as a mini review. Even though, again, take everything I say with a grain of salt. Like, it's always up to the player themselves to experience the game and have their own opinions on it. But when it comes to Catherine, it is a game that has a very fun story with uncertain characters, I, I would say, at points. Because, because not just that Vincent's like really uncertain, and I understand that's like the main point of it, but Vincent, sometimes his emotions do a complete fucking 180. It's... Sometimes he's a realistic person, right? Where like when he's talking to uh, the boss and confronting him about Catherine being real and he goes like, are you fucking with me? Don't fuck with me, I'm angry, right? Other times, suddenly Vincent feels like being heroic and saying, I will risk my life for the, for the good of the world, even though he really doesn't seem like that type of character. Um, but... I understand that Vincent is also, like, they also needed to 
come to that point in the story somehow and have it all make sense while vincent is also like a representation of the player which which is understandable uh but even not just vincent like uh k catherine to some point it's like she she says she's like scared about being pregnant and stuff like that but i mean she wouldn't if she was truly scared of it i don't think anyone would just come out and say it like right then and there and then later on change their mind in the middle of it well i mean there are people who would probably do it but but you know what i mean it's just like she's uncertain as hell too uh see Catherine. i guess she's the most certain one because she knows that her job uh like her job in the game there is just to, you know and the story is just you know to be the succubus and seduce all the men and and be like come on and do the schmaxy time with me even though i don't think she gets physical with any of them at all uh yeah um now overall if you're someone who hate puzzle games well then of course you're not gonna play this game but if you're someone who loves a nice a, a nice mind-bending challenge of course you're gonna love this game you're gonna have a good time and then if you need more of that there's the tower of babel bullshit and then there's the uh, rapunzel stuff yeah i think yeah there's those stuff and then you get nice little rewards for them uh mainly like more music from from this game and other games in the jukebox of the stray sheep um yeah but i mean there's really not much to say about Catherine. One of the things that I, I really like about this, and not, not just the game itself, but more like the, I hate using this word, but the fucking community around it, is that Catherine was like, not a sleeper success, but like, I guess, a, a random, like a random boom of success when it came out. Uh, and that's because, of course, a lot of people played it on like YouTube and stuff, and a lot of people saw it. And, uh, of course, one of the biggest people playing it is, uh, I don't watch it, but is PewDiePie. He did play it at some point, I believe. We got a trophy, Nighty Night. That's awesome. I like that. So we're going to push this button. I'm not sure if we have a final cutscene or not, or if it will send us to the main menu. So let's see. Hey, where'd you go? Welcome to the Coliseum. Oh yeah, it's like two-player stuff. Oh no, it puts us in the main menu. Okay, well... That's the first time I've ever gotten that ending. Because I wasn't sure if it would lead to the other endings like... Like, Vincent goes to space and stuff like that. Or Vincent, like, wins wins a bet or loses a bet or something like that, you know? Those are, those are some of the other endings, but... Like I said earlier, I will, I will, um, show the other endings off in a separate video. It won't have any commentary at all, so you guys can watch that as much as you want without hearing my annoying voice. But, if you love this playthrough, if you love this game, and you hate me, please hit the subscribe button. I had a lot of fun doing this. Hit the subscribe button, uh, leave a comment as to what what do you think a good addition will be in Catherine full body when that comes out right because i'm pretty sure there's a besides rin the new character uh i'm pretty sure there'll be like some things they can fix one of the major things being like the audio levels in this fucking game is kind of crazy at points but but to repeat myself because i don't know why i'm repeating myself Comment, like, subscribe, all that good jazz. Mo most importantly, share it with friends. Share it on Twitter. Retweet my tweets. I don't know. Follow me on Twitter. It's in the description if you want to do that. Um, and yeah, next time we see Catherine, it will be Catherine full body. And next time we see Atlas, it may be one of their famous JRPG series. Who knows? anything to happen but yeah like always i want to thank all of you for watching and i'll see you in the next video